I am a fan of Golden Hoops. Pass goes to Stanley Johnson. He goes under the like, shot clock getting low and shoots it. And then certainly quite literally could jump out of the gym. Coffee pressed for time. Higher with the 7-4 guy. Giddy fake pass, then gives it up for Holmgren. Play making. Jalen Williams, here's left, pulls up, looking for the lead, and got it! Jalen Williams, two seconds, 111-105! Shea, quickly, and Harris, he's got it in the slalom down, and Shea elevates to the rim! This is looking to run, not going to finesse it this time. I'm going to bend the rim! Dangerous ones. Getting looking, looking. Holmgren's got it, turns, fires. He hit it! Well, he was on the line, though, I think. He might have been on the line. So it went to 0-0. Zero, zero. They got to review it. It automatically goes to... Shea, once again, with Curry defending, pulls up. And the dunk on the fly-in from Lou Dort, who came out of nowhere to punch it home. You know, Shea draw, draws so much attention. He just ran right down and tipped him. Young wants that step back three, but Lundor just swallows up the space with a block. How about the lob up top to Jada? That may have been a play of the game right there, folks. All the time, he can throw him down to the G League. And you need him because you know over the course of a full NBA season, you have guys. On the night, it ties the pockets. OKC runner for the most blocks of two games. Shea just glued Jaron Jackson Jr. to the floor as the two-way effort continues. And the one-two punch of the defensive blocks of Holmgren. Travel itinerary following your favorite NBA team once again. Chet, little home run pass, right? It was Giddy. Look at that. 80 feet up the floor. Thunder assistant coach Grant Gibbs at halftime about how the Thunder was able to withstand early shooting from Brooklyn to start this game. He told me that stylistically the Nets are a movement and shooting team and in that first quarter Thunder took a little time to calibrate to that. Those arenas. It is your chance to make your voice heard. You talk about making your voice heard. How about that? Jay Dunn. Just a 68-63, Nuggets playing catch up in the free throw department. And again, Michael just kind of gets run over, and now he's out of the picture. 12-13 in a row. <laughs> Jay with the slam. It's so hard for a team. Going right back to the success that he has had, Isaiah Joe lets it fly, counted in a foul! The three counts the foul on that first quarter. And LeBron got wiped away on the help defense from Chet Holmgren. It's a two. shot. And it pops out to J Dub two on one. The Thunder once again on the run. And it's going to be hold him up. This is one of those plays you can wipe a guy out and probably get a flake of one or two, but he holds him up. I'm not really sure why, because he was pretty much ahead of him. Shea deciding what he wants to do. Spinning on Randall, got inside, and then he scoops it up and in off the glass. What a move. 31 13 second quarter. Shea got a little hesitation, and this time goes with the left hand for the jam. And, and sometimes he just shows us something different. Now, I mean, we've been watching him all season, folks. Shea a steal. Giddy behind the back just floats it the other end. SGA dumps it off. Jada looking for space and Thoda on both ends. Look at that nifty pass. Josh Giddy knew where his teammates were. Ooh, otherwise yes. they're not going to get the ball. They're not going to get a chance to shoot. 
Oh my goodness! Oh, Shane kill just Alexander somehow, and then it's going to be a technical foul because the ball got Shane Gilgis Alexander on the dribble drive, turn two, got it. Wow, big shot for him. He played with the ball too long. Of the season, Gordon turns the corner. Coming underneath at Holmgren, collapses him. The NBA, free throw attempts a game at over 11. And Going vertical and a beautiful alley oop. And I tell you, Josh took that. Well, because the championship game is going to be the 83rd game for the two participants. Because that is now the sweetest service. They had defended the entire game, even though the offense wasn't going. Hey! And what a block inside by Chet Holmgren. He had two big blocks against Minnesota. Guarding LBJ with this move. Shake Gilchus Alexander, throw it down. I was just going to say they got to somehow get the ball out of his hand. So effective. Holmgren with a rebound of the Jovic miss. A dart. Oh my, high wire exploits for the Thunder. It was Jalen Williams on the throwdown. Seconds to go. Shea to J Dub. It's good if it goes, and it's good. Little up and under, off the backboard! Chet Holmgren set it up for himself! <laughs> I'm laughing right now, folks. I gotta I got tell you something in a second, but... <laughs> so that when he catches the basketball, he doesn't have to put it on the floor. This time it's SGA. He will step into it from deep and bury another three! A lot of pressure on him. And the lob to Holmgren. How about that connection? Jalen Williams. He's got confidence in his physicality on the step back shot. It got rejected by Holmgren as he just swallowed up that. If they're going to play fast and allow Giannis to go coast to coast, you've got to do the same. How about that? Same play, except this time it results in authoritative jam. 